good morning, Sigal High School. Remember tonight, uh, girls basketball starts the district tournament at 6 o'clock at Oakland, and tomorrow night, boys basketball is at Oakland as well, district tournament. Uh, starts at 6 as well, I do believe. Uh, as all you know, we saw the tragedy that took place in Florida yesterday with school security and safety, a uh, major concern. Teachers will be sending out some changes that we're going to implement just to make sure we're covering our bases best we can do. There's many things that we can do, but of course, uh, we just got to be uh, eyes open and see what's going on. So I wanted Officer Sanders to come on this morning to talk a little bit about uh, things to be looking for, things to do, etc. Uh, good morning, CEO High School. Uh, it's a tragic situation, but it's also an opportunity to provide a safer uh, school atmosphere here at Siegel High School. Uh, so, in saying that, here's some of the things that we really need to think about. We really need to think about the doors. I know it's always uh, friendly and polite to open a door for somebody who's coming into the school between classes or, or after the period bell is rang, but it's really not a secure thing to be doing. So anybody who's late needs to come, about, come around to the front office and come in just like normal people do who visit the high school. You have no idea who you're letting in or what their purpose for being on campus is. Uh, also, uh, whenever somebody is walking around on campus that you do not know, does not seem to be here, looks out of place, that needs to be reported right away as soon as possible. Also, uh, adding on to that, students. Anytime that you're aware of, of, of another student or maybe a prior student who is making any kind of statements that seem inflammatory, dangerous, out of character, um, you need to report that. You need to report any Snapchat, social media, uh, text messages that are of a threatening nature so that we can be acted on and not taken lightly. Uh, this young man in Florida apparently had set up many signals that this was something he was preparing to do and they were ignored each and every time. So uh, let's keep all these things in mind moving forward. We're going to be trying to make you some changes around here at Siegel High School and let's all be safe in coming to school and getting ed education. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Sanders. Thanks. Have a great day, Siegel. Yeah. The student council picture roster is posted outside of uh, Ms. Mart's room, room 113. <laughs> Only those members who earn 30 points are allowed to be in the picture. Please check the roster today and let Ms. Martz know if you think you should be on the roster uh, if you are not. If you are ri a rising junior or senior and earning three hours of college credit while learning about human behavior, take CLEP Psychology. Any questions, see Ms. James in room 708. Now on to you, Sam. Thanks, Tucker. Come and support the track and field team. Eat at Chipotle between 5 and 9 on Tuesday, February 20th. Tell the ca cashier that you're supporting Siegel Track and a portion of the proceeds will be donated to the team. NAEP students, or seniors, a reminder to turn in your NAEP form to Ms. Serrano today if you have not already done so. That's all for your announcements, Siegel. Have a... Pitch is a hater. Thursday. Thursday.